I paid to have it delivered. I absolutely do not want to take it now. I'm not doing all that. This battery was dying. I just got back from the laundromat and I'm about to unpack my clothes. Forgot this stupid battery was dying. Towel. We'll go in the bathroom. I have a pair of jeans. Actually. I bought one bottle of Suave, and Jesus Christ, the clothes smell good. The blue one, oh my gosh, because my friend has the purple one, but this blue one really sucks. I have all these sports bras that I've either been working out in or just wearing underneath my scrubs every day. Put one on now in case I'm gonna wear this one tomorrow. In case I'm gonna do a little workout, I'll put that on. Not in case I'm definitely gonna do a workout. I wonder I couldn't find damn shirts and thought I didn't have any. Biker shorts. I need to find the one that I just bought. So that I can try it on and see how it fits. Because I bought it on Amazon for cheap and wanted to see if I'd want to buy more. Considering what the quality was like. Come all the way up here so I can try it on. Look, my reflection is definitely showing. So we're gonna try it on and see what it's giving. Inventory, where's the back? And where's the front? I'm gonna just assume that this here is the back. Okay, I like this. And I just washed it. I feel like I could still size down and I would be fine because it's kind of roomy. So I'm going to try sizing down. Well, these drawers are either very full or things are not folded up properly. And right now, it's feeling like they're not folded properly. So many damn black shirts in here. And I still bought under one the other day. This is the one thing I like about when I work at the nursing home because like in the evenings I would still have time to do something else. Like I could come home and still have enough time to like get some laundry done or whatever. When I work my other job, I don't really have that luxury. Like I'm lucky if I come home and have enough time to take a shower and make like a small meal. Like there just isn't enough time for all of that. So now I need to put this towel in the bathroom. These smell so good. This is exactly how I love when my clothes smell good. Ugh. I'm getting so excited to just get dressed because they smell so good. So I need to go on Amazon and buy some more of this brand. Because it fits really nicely. Put the sports bra on. And now that I'm changed, we're going to see if we can get a nice little workout in. So I need to put my sneakers on and my socks because when I work out and just like barefoot or I or I just wear socks, I'm slipping off of the yoga mat. Seen a yoga mat too that I needed to buy for a couple of days now. That still has not happened yet. So we're looking a little soldier up. But we're gonna do a quick little workout and put some more of these in my cart because it's getting warmer and in the summer months I'm definitely going to be 
outside walking and for the workouts these shorts are gonna have to work but um yeah you know i'm here walking home and i'm just thinking the people at the post office really have me fucked up right imagine i ordered a package so many days ago for it to have been delivered tuesday today is friday right i requested a re-delivery two days ago it was not delivered nothing is updated so i go to the post office and i'm asking like what is going on like why wasn't the package re-delivered and why is it like not updated online or anything what's going on the lady goes to the back no first she asks me for my name she goes to the back and then she i don't know she checks on something right and then she comes out and tells me that oh um do you want to take it now so i'm just like no like i paid to have it delivered i absolutely do not want to take it now i want to get it delivered because it's heavy i had no intentions of taking that package with me because i already know it's in there and i already know that it's heavy so i'm like no i want to have it re-delivered she goes back there takes forever the line is building up and then she comes back and she says yeah um the reason why it hasn't been delivered yet is because um she said first of all who's she she said we don't have anybody to deliver it and um so because of that like she's gonna try and see if she could have them delivered um tomorrow which is saturday or tuesday but here's the thing like when they deliver it they're gonna leave it outside and i'm like i did expect them to leave it outside the last time when they were supposed to deliver it like i didn't expect that that item was gonna fit inside a mailbox like it's huge it's a massive item that was never supposed to go in the mailbox so for the lady to even have tried to deliver it and say that it couldn't fit in the mailbox when she knows good and well she never had that thing on the truck is just upsetting like yeah let them deliver it and bring it around to the back normally when packages are delivered whoever's home will bring the packages to like the backyard or they will take it inside and like put it in the entryway area and whoever lives upstairs will pick their packages and you know obviously whoever's downstairs will pick theirs but like i'm not paying for delivery just to come to the post office and pick the item up and call an uber to come bring it home now deliver it this is what i'm paying for so today or monday like it's cold anyways today or monday deliver it i don't want to take it home with me i'm not doing all that hi guys it's a few hours later honestly i just came home and slept my initial plan was to sleep for like an hour and i got home like a little after four o'clock and so i set an alarm to i set an alarm for 5 50 and i slept from like about 4 20 to 5 50 and that just felt like the best sleep in life when i woke up i didn't even want to get up like i just wanted to <laughs> continue sleeping but i knew that that would mess up my sleep tonight had i done that so I took my time, like I was laying there for about another 30 minutes, just laying there because the bed was warm and everything, and then I eventually got up and moved out here to the living room because I wanted to let my body realize that I was awake because I feel like laying down in the bed did not help with my body realizing that, listen sis, you're awake, get up and do something. Like, I felt like maybe I still thought I was sleeping, so... I came out here and started watching a few YouTube videos. That's pretty much all I have going on right now. I, at one point, felt like I was going to cook something, but I quickly changed my mind. I think there's some food in the fridge, so I'm going to put a little bit of food in a container where I can take with me to work for lunch tomorrow, And um, because tomorrow I work all day, and then I guess I'm going to just figure the rest out. But um, I'm tired, and I feel like today I was supposed to work, both jobs too, but in the in like in the evening I started having like a slight headache and I just felt like I was tired because I hadn't slept all week and I'm working six days this week so I just called the manager and told him that I was stuck at work and I was stuck at the other job and I couldn't come and he was just like yeah okay no problem thank you because I knew that I just wanted to come home and sleep because I hadn't slept all week I was working out every evening and stuff like that and yesterday I went to do my laundry so you know my body just needed a little bit of rest a little bit of sleep to just bring me back up to speed and you know now i feel better hopefully tomorrow is a pretty decent day i'm hoping that i'm on the same floor tomorrow that would mean i'm i'm on this and the same floor for like three days today too like yesterday i was telling my friend that the assignment that i got it's kind of heavy and 
you know, I was posting Insta stories and she's like, how's the assignment heavy if you're posting Insta stories? And it's somebody else that told me that the assignment was heavy, one of the persons who, were, who was doing it before. And I feel like something that somebody else considers a little bit heavy might not be the same for me because I naturally work quicker. But today I'm just like, damn. When it got to 2 o'clock, like, it was a good thing I did my book before um, I went on lunch at 1. Because when it got to 2 o'clock, I was literally busy until it was time to go. Because, like, I was bringing people to the bathroom and, like, I had to change a Colossi bag and just so much was going on until it was time to go. And so, well, I like an assignment like that because it gives me something to do the entire time until it's time for me to leave. But sometimes I do like catching my breath in between, which I did have time to do that today if I'm being completely honest. But that's the, that's really kind of the day that I've had for the last two days. However, that's where I'm going to end today's vlog. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in the next vlog. <laughs>